Hi everyone, LazyFire here. Welcome back to Steam World Dig 2. Uh, we're just going further down. Nothing, uh, nothing desperately new on that front. We've got our objectives, which is to get to Vectron, and uh, that's where we're headed. So, before I go... Oh, that's just funny. I bet you could... If you time some stuff right, I'm imagining that those could actually be used to break the game fucking wide open. Um, the most important tool. The hook shot. Uh, let's get around. Just over here. I don't think so. I think I did a pretty. Uh, yeah, I'm getting that. Oh. I could. Now I can. Oh, wait. No, I can't. Okay. Well, competence is uh, still a big selling point of this LP, I'm sure. Yeah, I was going to let that happen. Uh, Oh yeah, that's right, they don't kill each other. Oh wait, yeah, they do. Just gotta tempt them at the right time. Yeah, that's right. I thought the uh, falling off the edge would do that, but I was wrong. Worked out. Right? The right people died. Everything's cool. If you want to come over here, come on, yeah. Bye. I'm just going to let these guys break themselves out. That's a totally appropriate way of doing this because I'm going to just murder them after. So what does it matter? No longer desperately incompetent at combat in this game, so I'll say that and then do that. No, my plan was to let him drown. That, that's right. Definitely a plan to actually get there. Okay, good. I'm not going crazy. For a second, I thought the uh, there was a difference made there. So I was like kind of excited, like, oh good, yeah, I can torture everybody by uh, using my pick on things that don't need to be picked. Okay. There we go. I see something on fire below. Oh no. Excellent. I like the part where it wasn't on fire. Pick only needing two hits to kill a guy and knocking it back the first time. Is kind of great. Okay, yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking here. Ha! Oh. Oh, that was so well placed. I couldn't have done that if I wanted to on purpose. Uh, is that, that was a weird mission that I'm incompetent, but whatever. It's true. assume that that was going to lead somewhere, but no. It's fine. Doesn't have to. Damn it. Damn. 
There. One out of the three had to work. Also. Also. Get in the water. There's the one cog upgrade that allows for um, more orbs for or for better prizes from uh, creative kills, but only creative kills. And I feel like there's not enough hazards like that to really justify taking them full time anyways. Like, there's definitely damn you. Hey, hey. Trying to do creative kills while talking about it is clearly not God's plan. Um, so yeah, like the creative kills idea, I like it a lot as just a concept in this game. Man, it's just there are areas like this where you can definitely get them close, but in areas like we were in the temple and such, uh, there's fewer areas for those sort of kills to be done, and so that kind of just, lowers your ability to make use of that. And I guess if I was thinking about it, not enough space. I haven't seen a... Uh, I really like that. That's, I know I've been really crappy about actually using it. So it's coming as this kind of a surprise of how much I enjoy it. Oh, you sure. Get down here. What I need is a water tank upgrade. Because I'm probably going to be using that thing a lot. Okay. There we go. Third time's the charm. All right. Wow, I did not make much progress in this uh, segment here at all. Holy crap. I don't see much of a better way of that. I don't know why I just did that. I'll just get that on the back. I just want to make a much cleaner path because I remember this being kind of a mess. It's... That should make things a little bit better on there. Oh, that always makes me feel really good. I, I don't know why, but like being able to move pretty effectively through there just makes me feel good about it. Oh, oh, wow. It was like almost as much money as I just had. Right. Let's see. I mean, I can use more jack camera upgrading, but the water tank. I feel like at this point I should actually be saving some money. What does this need? No. I mean, okay, so. Yeah, okay. I feel like that's a good trade for the moment. You can always come back and remodify these things, which I know that I forget because I've been running the same mods for like almost the entirety of the game um, and just upgrading or increasing whatever I have. But I feel like that is a pretty good set of choices I just made. So I haven't seen any lava or acid in here for quite a bit. So that's, that's one thing. And now my light won't drop below 50%. 
and I also don't technically need light orbs. Now, the annoying part is going to be that, or I'm going to get more uh, orbs in, that would be used for water, so I don't have to go and find pools all the time, which is one of my concerns and why I bought that water tank upgrade in the first place. Yeah, murder. I don't want to fight in that narrow ass confines. You got yourself stuck in, bruh. about half, having to go back home, uh, or back to the town. Jeez. All right. And I'm assuming this section of wall here is actually going to be probably the last bit I have before getting to a new area with a new pipe. If I had to guess. All right. Of course, now I'm like, in this mindset where I'm just free to use as much water as I want. Yeah, this super looks like a path to a next area. Right, we're not gonna do super side by side. What? Hey, how did I not grab that? Besides giving you water to keep going through this, because you know somebody got stuck at some point. Gonna die. Ooh, sign. if I didn't go exactly where the game seemed to be pointing me to with the actual literal sign that I would be rewarded. Oh, this feels like an escape area. Like, I'm gonna have to get out of here. Ooh! Get there. Aha! Who doesn't just enjoy a good Cthulhu joke? All right. Why am I doing this the exact way the game does not want me to do it? I don't know. There we go. Good. I, <sighs> come on, there we go. See? Not incompetent. Just most of it. Just getting paranoid now, but it's got to be more. Just keep feeding me more things for your game. And where's this? Place? sure uh, what all that was. I should actually, now that I've done all this, go back to town real quick. There we are. Sell off my stuff. Why not? 
I've got money. Oh, well, hold on. Okay. So for two, I have one. I mean, magnet is nice, but I'm not gonna need it. So. There. A very, very short time skip. You're all welcome. Check out these speedrunning strats. Huh. I can't shoot this yet. Sure, if this is where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. All right. Well, let's just do this normal then. Everyone thought that that was going to be something up there, right? Because I, the second I saw like a, a seeming dead end with an open area, I was like, yeah, it's got to be something. Right now, I seem to be opening up shortcuts as I go down. Grip onto that. Huh. Sorry. I'm going to avoid responsibility like I always do and go check something out real quick. that thing over there down there is a teleportation portal that just like puts me on another area of this I don't know how to get there I mean Fen I am a highly competent individual how could you even question this? we're going to fall slowly. Because I just don't want to take an entire drop down to the bottom here. That, that seems like a bad plan. This game knows all too well that I'm dumb enough to do it. Oh, I guess I could. Oh, well. Anyways, 
Uh, looks like the start of this. So, uh, next time, oh, yeah, fine. Next time, we're, uh, we're gonna go deeper into Vectron. See everyone then. Bye.